Will you look at your name and repeat the subject for tonight's sermonic presentation? Everybody turn to somebody and say, The doors the of the church. You may be seated in the presence of our God. Look over at your neighbor and repeat the subject again. Look at, why don't everybody just turn to somebody better looking than you are? Then you go and like you can't find nobody better looking. Well, if you can't find anybody better looking, then just find somebody looking. And tell them with your most vociferous uh, voice. Come on, say the doors of the, of the church are open. My brethren, I solicit your prayers by the preachers. I need your help here. Uh, now, you don't have to help me if you don't want to, but all I'm going to say is maybe you reap everything you say. If anybody ought to get with a preacher, it ought to be. It ought to be another preacher. Uh, as I, with you, take an attentive perusal of this particular scriptural passage, look down in that 28th chapter again. Take your minds towards the text and read that 22nd verse. The Bible says, and in the time, what? Talk to me, somebody. In the time of his Look at your neighbor tell you got to watch what you do when you're under pressure. You got to watch the decisions you make. You got to watch the people you choose to align yourself with when you're in distress. Are you listening to me? The Bible declared that when he was in distress, did he trespass yet more against the Lord? And he was talking about here, Ahaz. In other words, he was already outside the will of God. And when things got even tougher, he decided to even go worse. My brothers and sisters, you got to watch the devil. All for you to say, don't let the devil ride. Because if you let him ride, you will want to try. The devil will take you further than you want to go and keep you longer than you want to stay. You got to watch the devil. The devil will have you doing things you said you'd never do. I don't hear nobody talking about Oh, so you're going to sit up there and act like you ain't never been on no trip with the devil. You're going to sit there and act like you have never made a mistake. Don't you let these self-righteous fillers of a pharisaical zealot sitting up in here looking down their self-righteous nose at the girl that's got a baby out of wedlock? It wasn't that you didn't do that, you just didn't get caught with yours. Look at your neighbor tell you bad, shout on this, come shout on this, shout on this. How dare you sit there like a proud peacock? I don't hear nobody talking to me. You know you've sinned, and you've sinned since you've been saved. Look at your neighbor and say, have to, have to. You've got to be careful of the decisions you make when you're under pressure. Our young women, I look at them sometimes, you act like death standing on the corner waiting on a lifesaver. Act like you're on a man, huh? gotta find a man, a man, a man, gotta, baby, everything in preachers is not a man. You're so desperate till you let him stay in your house. I don't hear nobody talking to you. Wear out your furniture, eat up your food, drive your car, and ask you for gas money. You ought to tell that natural head Negro, I don't need no man to do that. And some of you so desperate till you done accepted one of them sweet daddy. What they call them? Some of y'all know what I'm talking about. You got to watch what you do when you're under distress. Don't you let anybody make you give up your morality. Don't you let anybody rip you and strip you of your dignity. Don't you let anybody make you think that you can practice sin and stay in fellowship with God. I don't have nobody talking to me. 
Man calls sin unusual, but God calls it abomination. Man calls sin a blunder, but God calls it blindness. Man calls sin a slip, but God calls it suicide. Man calls sin weakness, but God calls it wickedness. Man calls sin a trifle, but God calls it a tragedy. The wages of sin is... Don't you let the enemy fool you, and don't you allow the devil to convince you that you can make alliances with sinful people. Talk back to me, somebody. 